Almost with some friends. Going to be exploring Gurgaon today, which uh, has been on my bucket list for India for a very long time. Just because of how modern I've heard the cyber city is. Does it live up to the hype, Chirag? Yes, sir. It will. It will. I'm very, very excited. Today's plan is ice skating, cyber city, and then go karting. Kind of reminds me of cyberpunk. Funny story about that. I actually bought that on Google Stadia. So I bought it in about 2021. But then I got my back pain soon after. So then I didn't actually get a chance to play it. But they just discontinued Stadia in 2023. And they refunded the amount for that I paid for the game. Isn't that insane? This is how businesses should be, you know? It's always customer focused and like, of course, profit driven because that's what a business needs to do. But if you don't have your customers, you don't have your profit. You guys were in Gurgaon? At least some part of it. So nice. So this is Arman. And this is Ignut. And we are, I guess we can say childhood best friends since what grade? Quantum class? Third? Fourth class. Oh. <laughs> the, the memories are so long ago that uh, we sometimes forget which years what things happened. They're not like high tech file or anything like that. Maybe like Google glasses on. Epic. Dude, imagine him in the ice skating rink. Dude! Dude. <laughs> this is really good actually. In India, they charge extra for water cups and uh, also for takeout containers. Sometimes they do. It's nice to see such like a nice modern looking building with such aesthetic colors in India. Quite rare to see. But I mean, I guess it's called Cyber City for a reason. That's completely. Go-karting? 
What do we need to discuss? Who's gonna lose? Pollution, I'm gonna do. Give you odd one or two of square this is. Yeah. I'm going to transfer my power to my power. What an interesting turn of events. So here we have one more. I think that we should not go today. What do you think? That's the thing about being a leader. You need to make tough decisions. And here we have one more. Call in the final shot. Let's go. 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 day before yesterday morning and obviously the birthday festivity is completely unexpected I didn't really plan anything for my birthday not intentionally but more so just like you know like we were we had busy plans with work and things like that and I didn't really expect to do much for my birthday but it was so nice of everyone to still make an effort you know even hanging out with my friends today they, they made a huge effort to go get some uh, desserts um, and apparently a, a bigger effort to find a candle to light up uh, to put on the dessert, but it was, it was super nice of him to do that. So yeah, leaving for Poland tomorrow morning. Should be an interesting 10, 11 days. I'm more so excited now for the next 10 days to manage the team remotely. I think whenever I'm going on these trips and traveling, it's always a good test as in, am I still able to manage the team in the same way as being there in person? Because if so, that opens up a world of opportunities for me, right? Because at that, that means I can work from anywhere. I'm very excited to work with the team over the next 10 days and excited to see the adventures that lie ahead in Poland and Germany.